Hello YouTube, I'm Steve Adams on the team. I give channel two. We are on Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. We'll be showcasing for you guys the HBO A3, which did release uh, or receive a weapon buff really recently in this last patch. Um, basically what it did to it, it increased the damage range, and now it's, um, it's a lot better with range and stuff, because before, uh, the, the max damage range, if you're wondering, is the range at which you will kill someone with three bullets. Now, it's a really good weapon now, overall, for all ranges at this point. It still doesn't have the fire rate as much as the Bell 27, which is pretty much still the dominant uh, weapon of choice for assault rifles, but, um, it's up there now, more so than it was. Now, basically, before the buff, um, the distance, the max, or er, max damage range, or whatever it's called, I can't remember at this point, I don't know why, just had a brain, uh, you know, but, uh, basically, it used to be 200, uh, meters, what they call it, I'm not sure the specific name for them, um, cubes or something, cubic things, whatever they are. I don't think it's, like, an actual measurement system that's, like, meters or feet or something. They, they were using something, I can't recall what it was, but, um, basically it was 200 of those, right? And the BAL-27 was 300, and it had more, uh, fire rate and less, uh, blowback. Whatever it's, blowback, you know, how much it hops up. Uh, so basically that made the Bell 27 a lot better of a choice for using an assault rifle, because this is a fast-paced game, so you want something like that. But, um, now that there was a buff put to it, it actually has a lot longer of a range for a uh, three-shot kill. It's, um, I'm not sure the exact distance, I couldn't find it, but basically it's even farther than the Bell 27 at this point. So it does make it a lot better of a weapon, a lot more usable if you're on those longer range maps. Um, so it's a gun I suggest you guys try out. It's it was uh, I really liked it in the very start of the game, but I kind of grew away from it. The iron sights on it are pretty good. Um, it does have a lot of damage, which is why I loved it at first. So that's another thing to take into consideration. I'm not sure if the battle has more damage or if it just usually does better because it has um, a, ha a faster fire rate. So I suggest you guys go try this out. Let me know how you fare with it. Um, this is the first match that I used it. Uh, so if you guys do try it out, let me know what you think about it down below. But uh, anyway, that's pretty much the buff that was received to the uh, HBR A3. As I said already, it's a much better weapon, much more usable now. But um, thank you for watching the video, and if you did enjoy it, please leave a like as it ups out more than you know. And I hope to see you next time.